Hello, pilots. Welcome back to this amazing flight here. We're currently over New York, guys, and I have to say, honestly, um, I'm impressed. I'm absolutely impressed by this amazing, super detailed Spitfire that Aeroplane Heaven has brought us. And check that out down there. We got an F-14, got a couple of cool planes down there. Submarine, that's an awesome museum. I gotta go check that out. But guys, forget that. Check out the Spitfire. Look at the level of detail we have here. And it works in VR. And honestly, that's probably the most ridiculous thing about this, um, which is just way too cool. Now, another thing is I'm having a blast flying here through New York with this Spitfire. And right now my settings are really cranked up. Um, they're on high. I think cloud are on high or ultra. Uh, resolution open XR is really high. And the render scale is set to 100. I know it's a very basic model Spitfire, but still, flying through New York in VR with Reverb G2 at 4K is no small feat. And I have to say, I'm going to put up my other video later on in which I'm flying in Hawaii in the Caronado Seminole. And it's an absolute blast. And I talk about the driver update that we got from NVIDIA. So that is going to be absolutely amazing. That's not an April Fool's joke. Uh, that's actually how I'm getting this so smooth. So the latest drivers, uh, I'll tell you right now, it's 465.89. Um, it's absolutely amazing for the 3000 series GPU. So definitely check that out. And look at the exterior of this model, guys. I mean, is this not amazing? The level of detail here. This is what I've been waiting for. Honestly, you know, you have everybody else trying to put together these planes and charging these crazy prices. This is the quality. This is a type of realism that Austin Myers wishes he could pull off in X Plane 11. I mean, this is next level right here, guys. Next level. This plane is, I mean, the flight dynamics, this honestly blows away anything in X-Plane 11. Look at these shadows. Unbelievable. And actually, have I showed you my chair? Is this chair not the most amazing thing in the world? I feel like if I built a cardboard Spitfire, that's exactly what I would put. A lawn chair, a plastic lawn chair. But look at this. My gauges work. I don't even know what that means. Climbing. Oh, there we go. That's the climb rate. Speed. My... The other ones don't work. Fuel. I mean, if this, where is this thing carrying the fuel though? I mean, I feel like I'm, I'm pretty flammable if I'm carrying any amount of fuel. So this is just the coolest thing ever. And look at all these ships here, which those ships are a mod. I'll eventually link to that mod later, but honestly, let's land this bird. And let's thank Aeroplane Heaven for creating this. It does have gear. It's not visible, but it is there. So let's change grips here. Looks like they got a traffic jam over here, like the Suez Canal. All right, here we go, guys. We're going to bring this bird in for a landing. I cannot believe how smooth this is, guys, honestly. And I'm in New York. A little hot. Oh gosh. We're gonna go, we're gonna go, we're gonna go. <laughs> All, right. All right, let's do this again. So I'm not sure which of my throttle is controlling this because I had this set up for um, a twin right before this and I have not reconfigured this so there we go I just want to keep that stall horn there reverse oh, we're going to hit this no matter what brakes Guys, this was the most ridiculous thing ever. Link is below. This is freeware. 
it costs zero FPS. In fact, I think it gives you FPS when you fly this plane. Go check it out. And uh, shout out to Aeroplane Heaven for making this for us. This is just way too funny. This is the most ridiculous thing ever. Anyways, guys, uh, stand by for that second video that I'm going to have later on reference the updated drivers, but <laughs> have a good day. Happy April Fools. And uh, let me swap out of this monster creation here. This is just too funny. Check out how cool that is. The ships are moving. <laughs> 